All right, back again, Luke here. And today we've got out our makeshift driving setup here, and I figured we could put in this game here. Double Axle, made by Taito. So, let's pop this on and play some of that. This may be a little bit tricky to see here. Like I said, this is a bit of a homemade setup, like most of my other setups are. And a little bit difficult to get all in the uh, frame here, or all in the picture. This thing turned on. See if we can adjust this angle a little bit. I don't know how well you'll be able to see here, but So because the sound effects here are quite loud and uh, there's not really much music, I've kind of turned it down a little bit so you guys can just kind of focus on the picture a bit. So we've only got two gears here. We've got low and high and just excel and break. Uh, there is a turbo button on the side here. You'll notice up here in the corner. So let's go ahead and pop in some credits. And at the beginning here, you can choose between uh, four different tracks, Demolition Derby, the uh, Cross Country, Mud Bog, and Icy Road. We'll just try the first one. And you'll notice on the right here, this is your rival, which you've basically got to either run off the road or uh, keep him at bay here in order to win the race. Because he does come out of nowhere. You can plow into him a few times and uh, he'll wind up disappearing, but got our nitrous here, which is kind of cool. Uh, this game is really uh, an interesting one from back in the day. Normally this thing would be much whoa, better played with uh, two people, kind of as a head-to-head, -head, but it is still fun in this mode here with, um, you know, head-to-head -head meaning like uh, with another physical player instead of the CPU or the PC here or the uh, computer. But it still is fun to play against him. He's quite strong, but if you had a friend or so that you could play against with another board, kind of system link it, uh, it'd be even more interesting, I think. Wow! But he is evil. <laughs> I knew he was going to do that. <laughs> but you can see the graphics for its time, and not too bad. I really like the scrolling aspects of it. This is a much older game here, but... It did take a lot of work to try and get up and running. Uh, this was a, another non-working board. Oh, he spun out. Nice. Another non-working board. And it requires a lot of different rewiring in order to get working here because the board is not pure straight JAMA. Uh, it does require a lot of changes for the video outputs as well as the sound and the controls for it. See if we can make him spin out once more. But not so many monster truck games out there, you know, for the old arcade. Which is what makes this one really neat for its time. He spun out again. I think he's probably going to catch up at the end. That's where I'm gonna fall. <laughs> I don't have anything else that I can use to catch up to him. So he's gonna cross that finish line. Uh. <laughs> there he is. There's the finish line up there. No! No, no, no! Oh, he hit a tree! What? Did I finish second?
I think I got second. No, I got first. Maybe? <laughs> I'm not sure. Maybe I was second. <laughs> we just finished the race nonetheless. But you can see it's kind of a bit of a simple game here. Um, you can put in your, your name. But this one here, not really worried about it. I think it'll keep the score until you turn it off. That's a bit of a cold day here, so I figured uh, do a little bit of some arcade gameplay. Some things that I've gotten wired up here. I've got a couple other boards that I've also wired up, so might do some more driving vids on those as well. But I'll show you a couple other ones here. Let's try let's try the demolition derby just for fun. I see basically all you got to do is destroy more obstacles than the opponent. Let's see if there's any way to readjust this. Hit the jumps. But it's good fun for just crashing and stuff. This guy is cheating. Getting some buses there. Oh, I missed them all. Missing all the cars. He's got me beat here. You can see the number on the side there. Just 300. It's crazy. <laughs> much, much, much more here. And this one's got uh, like two stages, I think. So it's got the first one and the second one. But yeah, I just figured we could do some gameplay. It's really hard to get in front of this guy, especially since you only got one nitro, so. And he is tearing up everything. I'm getting this like all the scraps here. Ah. <laughs> oh, and off again. <laughs> totally destroyed. But just to give you guys a little bit of a look at what the game looks like here. It's becoming one of those boards that's a little bit more difficult to pick up. But the amount of work that it takes to get one of these going is quite a lot. So uh, a lot of people I think just don't find this uh, economically useful or friendly. Uh, like I mentioned before, the wiring and stuff that has to be done on the board is one thing. The other thing that needs to be done is it has to have a specific um, spinner for the steering wheel. And I mean, I, you could use basically, I think, any spinner for it. But instead of using a potentiometer, it uses a spinner, which makes it a little bit more difficult as well. We'll try the mud race here. But what I managed to do inside in this one here is I've put a spinner as well as uh, a pot on the inside of it so you can use both of them with regular racing games as well as this one <laughs> try and run over the uh, crowd members here but nonetheless I just want to share with you guys a little bit of a look at what double axle looks like here for the arcade nice and uh, it's a pretty neat arcade game here like I said it's an old one it takes a lot of work to get up and running but definitely kind of fun to play especially with monster trucks but that's about all for me for right now like always I'll put up another video here soon so thanks for watching
some monster truck madness. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> I think the battery is actually going out in my camera as well, so we'll play it until, until we run out of battery power, I think. Woo, that was close. <laughs> How did he get up there? That's what I want to know. Try and save a couple of my nitros here, maybe towards the end, when I need them. Whoa, that was close. Woo! Getting close to the walls. Ah. Come on, boost. Whew. Oh, he crashed. <laughs> oh, he crashed again. What? This guy is relentless. Crashed again. <laughs> uh, final lap. Can we make it? <laughs> what a garbage is getting thrown out of here. Woo wee! Off the road. Wow, that was kind of stupid. Uh, why did I do that? Is there any way to catch up? <laughs> Losing it at the end. Oh well. If you guys stuck on this long, then fantastic. But thanks again for watching here, and we'll try to get up some more arcade-related videos and whatnot. Oh my gosh, where did that come from? <laughs> I'm going off course. Funny, there is no real course here. <laughs> yeah. And there we go. <laughs> so yeah, guys, we'll go ahead and we'll get some more videos put up here sometime soon. Maybe some ones where don't come in absolutely dead last, but <laughs> we'll see. Anyway, take care, guys, and we'll see you again here soon.